Similarly, we have that which is related to the worship of the Christmas tree. Again, uh, a practice, Ikhwan, that uh, was taken from uh, the uh, pagans. It was actually a cult, Ikhwan, and the followers of a cult called the Ashira cult, who uh, were individuals who were fought against uh, on the basis of their belief by the, by, by the or during the, uh, the Ro Romans, the, the Roman Empire, and in among the Roman Empire, because they worshipped trees. And they were pagans, again, who they attempted to call them to Christianity. They wouldn't leave their worship of trees. And so they said, you can incorporate, because they had one day when they would worship, which was a specific day of, of festivities and specific day of celebration, where they would worship the tree. And so within the Roman Empire, they allowed them to become Christian, and they said, or they came to an agreement with them, because the Christian empire was harsh and brutal in many ways in propagating Christianity. So they allowed them to become Christians, and they allowed them to bring their tree, and the, and the celebration of the tree into Christianity. But they said, instead of having it uh, on the day that you ordinarily celebrate it, bring it and celebrate it the 25th just as your friends and companions who who worship or who celebrate saturnalia yeah and they celebrate on the 25th bring that tree worship into uh and on uh during the same time and we can make it one big festival of celebration and you can incorporate your tree worship into that and they allowed them that and thus ikhwan we have the incorporation of the christmas tree uh, into uh, Christian celebration. And in fact, Ikhwan, in the Bible itself, those who decorate Christmas trees and worship them are dispraised and cursed in the Bible. There are, there are verses within the Bible that dispraise those who decorate trees and then worship those trees. That they cut them down, they decorate them, and they worship them. They're dispraised in the Bible. Yet still we see the exact same practice are being incorporated Ikhwan, into uh, Christian practice. Similarly, uh, the affair of giving gifts during uh, the festival. Again, Ikhwan, it has its origin uh, in uh, uh, pagan practice. It was there was uh, a female god in and among the pagan pagan you know, practice who was known for putting presents in a stocking to give to children, in a sock, and giving them to children. Again, Ikhwan, that paganistic belief was incorporated into the celebration of Christmas.